Yo, what is up? Are y'all ready to bring another vehicle back here? Dude. Dude, we don't have enough. This poor truck, dude. Oh. Oh, gang is pulling up at ACW today. Good morning, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we've got a lot of stuff planned for you guys. We are going to be working a lot more on the C7 Corvette, the giveaway car, wrapping it up. And right now at ACW, there is a uh, Lamborghini LP640, I believe, it looked like, getting delivered here. What's up, man? LP640, it's an LP610 Ford. All right, guys, the lift is freed up here at ACW, so we're gonna get this Corvette pulled in, put up on the lift, and get started on everything today. I'm super pumped about it, actually. I've got some huge announcements to make as far as tires go. We're gonna get some new tires put on this thing today. We're gonna get brakes replaced. Huge thanks to R1 Concepts for getting those sent over to us. It's gonna be amazing. Let's go ahead and get this thing pulled in and get started. <laughs> cool car it really is if you would like to grab inches in to win this thing don't forget guys you can go to it's just com or go download our new app right now where every single dollar spent we'll get you another entry in to win this badass car can you hold this yes thank you Danny. Extremely yeah, these actually are about us. So we got these L1 add-ons, little lift pucks, super cool. They basically just are like a billet spacer between the frame of the car. So whenever you slide a lift arm under there, you don't damage your side skirt or anything like that. Really easy to install. Slide this in, twist it, and then you tighten down so it clamps it. And pretty much that's it. Now we can take our lift arm and slide it here. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. These are four new tires back here. Okay. And then we've got just the four wheels that are back here. Okay. And then on this rear right side on the inner tire, this is the one that's low. And then I've got the socket for the big spike. Uh, spike I, I was going to ask. Okay. If it works, it works. Hey, it works. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate no it. Have a good one. Nice to meet you. Are you ready to go work on a car? Ready to go work on a car. OSHA would love this. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, got the feet on the lift and everything. <laughs> wow. Do not follow me, Corvette. Oh, there's a CS PMP sticker under here. Who did that? <laughs> OSHA approved. Oh my god. You got a piece of wood right behind me. Okay, then. I believe this will work. Danny, how have you been so wrong? Oh god, oh god, oh Jesus Christ. All right. Mm, I do not know if I'm loosening. Ah, that's how we get it, yeah! Danny, I believe I am to be too weak. You already made it this far, Gabby. Yeah, Gabby, you got this. You can keep going. Yeah. Ow! My ears. Careful, bro. <laughs> Alright, now the caliper might fall off, so be careful. Here's the rotor you're gonna need when the time comes. Thank you, Danny. Hey, look, Danny, could you get me a... Oh. A Torx? Oh, Could yes, you give me a torch that big? Come on, Danny. And then what? I don't know, Danny. What is this? Can you use this? Oh, finally got this damn caliper loosened up. And it is ready to come off. So we'll get this thing pulled out. Grab our old stock rotors that I completely toasted on the mountainside. And we slip our new ones on. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. Did you make sure it was Yep. Okay. Ta-da. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at the brakes. Look at the brakes, dude! Look at the brakes! There's no way you'll leave that in. There's no <laughs> There's way. There's no way you would, yeah. Dang it, no balls, dang it. Isn't what? that crazy you, that Daniel gets I'm talking to the, I'm talking to editor Daniel right now, in the future. Is she talking about? To the no, camera. He'll, he'll know. He'll yeah, know he'll know. He don't need to know right now. That's pretty nice. I like that. It, it is, is nice. nice Very nice and shiny. I do like that. Bro, these are so tight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm gonna pass out in a second <laughs> from squeezing so hard. Very nice one. Yeah, right oh shit, this one's fucking. Oh yeah? Now it's fucking. Yeah. yeah. Dude, that shit really just not moving. It should be a quick install, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> just pull the rudder out. There it is. God 
Yeah. It's a quick install with your friends. Pull the rotor off. <laughs> All right. New rotor. Make going. sure you line up the hole. Mm hmm. Where you hole? Top at? left. Top right. I'm trying to not to touch it with my hands. I'm trying not to drop the caliper with my hands. Okay. Wow. That thing was stuck. Yeah, it really was. I keep my eyes wide open all the time. The next day. You'll be good. You better be good. Tar be good. Mia be good. Guys, I am so pumped. Today we are taking the McLaren to get a line. Not only that, we're also going to be getting the C7 finished up and bringing it back home. we got Daniel and Nick with us. What up, guys? Yeah. Look at that fucking McLaren. Wow, that's pretty sharp. Wow. I wonder how much this alignment's going to be. I'm so excited. Right? I'm going to guess. You, what you thinking? Really, I'm going to guess like 350. I think that sounds reasonable for a sports car. I'm going to guess just to have some variety. 670. Oh, shit. Damn, Did you ever think that we were going to be able to just like do things like this? This yeah. is interesting. Oh, yeah. Okay. You did. Danny, yeah. Danny, Danny, Danny thought that. I was very confident in our ability, Gavin. That's why I dropped out of college with you, so we could be companions on this journey of success. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Wow. He has two different colored eyes. Cute spots. Ooh, hello. There you go, buddy. Thanks so much, man. Y'all have a good one. You too. We were all way off. Really? That was it like one, 150? 149.99. 149. Not bad. Great deal. Hell yeah, fast lane. Let's go. Well, we're gonna go take this thing and get an oil change at the dealership. And Daniel and Nick are gonna go pick up the C7, and we're gonna head back home. So there's only been really one car, two cars. I said a Plaid, but I also said a ZR1. That was the only two cars that I would trade the 600 for. I come in the showroom, and I'm looking at the 765 because, like, yeah, of course, yeah. But look at this. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you it better not, better not be a manual. It better not. Oh, okay, good, it's an auto. <laughs> we were already here with the car. I was like, damn, not how I saw that happening. It would make no financial sense, but I would sell every single thing that I have to get this car over. Smell that for a second. Yeah. Yeah, it's our triple eight R's on it. Honestly, I might get a Lotus. That would be interesting as well. What, what do y'all think? Should we buy this? I don't know really what we do. We take it to Amp and probably crash it to be honest. Can we ever jump on one of these? How much are the, is this one? 52. 52? Can we get it? Yep. I've never been around one of these cars or sat in one or anything. Wow, dude, look at Look at the gas pedal. Oh my goodness. Whoa. <laughs> this is incredibly simple inside. He says, follow me, I can open the race car. <laughs> oh my God, dude. Yeah, you're not kidding. This thing gets used like crazy. Oh my goodness. I have never in my life thought I would ever see anything like that. The wing light on this thing is just insane, dude. That is stupid. 55 or 75? 75. 75 of these. That is pretty crazy. <laughs> yeah, that is crazy. Well, we are finally headed back home, and uh, this is the moment of truth. So whenever we were dropping the car off earlier, we were making bets on how much this oil change was gonna cost. This is my very first ever oil change that I haven't done myself on a McLaren. I've done all of them until now. Drum roll, please. $827.08. Wow! $827 is what it took to change the oil and filter in this car, and we'll be back doing this probably in about another 1,500 miles. Sick. As for the Corvette, guys, we've got some kind of unfortunate news. As you see, the stock bumper is on the Corvette again, unfortunately, because the bumper that we got to the car did not fit worth a crap. I'm not even gonna lie to you, it was kind of an aggravating situation. We got the bumper in, they had sent us the wrong lip. It was actually for a Camaro. Contacted them, they didn't have one. We waited weeks, we get the lip in, the lip comes in, we open up the box and it is freaking broken. So on top of the bumper not fitting well, the lip was broken, the inner fender liners didn't look good, and truly, Justin at ACW did not want that car going out of his shop with his name on it and going to one of you guys with fitment issues like that, looking like that. We just didn't really feel good about it. So we threw the stock bumper back on, 
rewrapped it all and it looks good so we got some more aggressive really sick new kumo tires put on the back of here really really nice these are the extra ps 91s we got a set sponsored by those guys for the c7 so huge thanks to kumo go check out those tires they make amazing stuff the c7 apparently drove really well on the way home i haven't gotten to go drive it on the tires i need to go do some launches and see how it does this thing looks so sick Guys, 10 times entries is live now to win this C7 Corvette. That means every dollar spent is gonna count as 10 entries to win this car right here, plus $15,000 in cash. All you've gotta do is go to itsjustasix.com or go download our new app, It's Just a Six on the App Store. Buy literally anything and you might be the lucky person getting a phone call that you won this car right here. Yo, what is up? Are y'all ready to bring another vehicle back here? Dude. Dude, we don't have enough. We definitely need another one. Or two or three. Like we already I was have. just telling him, you know it would be great if we had another vehicle here. Specifically like one that was made for carrying four people. <laughs> you know what I'm yeah so today we are about to leave the house headed over to acw yet again every single video for the last 10 videos it seems like is going to acw but yet again we're going to acw this time i told you guys a few weeks ago that we had bought a vehicle secretly and today we're finally going to pick it up and you're probably like why did you buy it and you're just now picking it up weeks later well you're about to find out danny thanks for letting us all pile into your oh, caravan no problem, your chair bro. your That's chariot what things are for <laughs> to the right danny to the right to the right er, no. No. Ooh, 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 I'm so lit. Hey, yo, oh, yeah. Well, there it is, guys. We have, uh, we bought the Lightning. We bought literally the ACW and course the SEMA Lightning, and we are giving this thing away. It has been at Hellhorse Performance now for the last, I'd say, month or two. I brought it down there whenever I bought the black car down there. If you guys remember, I didn't tell you why, but that was why. We were wanting to get it fixed up and it ended up getting a whole new engine because this thing destroyed itself racing paint. And we, we heard you guys like fast trucks, so <laughs> why not? This is pretty exciting for us because this is our first truck giveaway or anything like that. We've never done an automatic vehicle. This is a 10-speed Whipple supercharged truck. You guys have absolutely loved all the videos that we've done with the race truck and everything in the past. So we figured for our very first time, why not try to do a truck? So we picked pretty much the best, craziest, most appealing truck that we could possibly think of and it's an ex SEMA vehicle so like <laughs> what? this is weird I've seen this truck so many times and it's weird to think that we're just gonna drive it home now <laughs> it's yours now I know <laughs> we're taking it home thanks for feeling I know hey, like what's happening here as you guys know I've got my own personal F-150 that I absolutely love and that's why I wanted to give the chance for one of you guys to win one of these trucks they're freaking amazing with the 10 speed auto trans in there this truck makes over 600 wheel horsepower, so that is so sick. But also, you guys have been wanting to see Hank get built, my other F-150. You guys have been wanting to see a built trans, and you've wanted to see head studs and make over a thousand horsepower with that truck. Just like all the vehicles at Midnight Performance, everybody always tags in their videos like, dude, look at this F-150, you need to make yours like that. So the goal of this giveaway is nothing else but to hopefully give this truck, of course, to one of you guys, but any of the profits or proceeds or anything from this giveaway, we are actually going to be using to try to build Hank even further. So we're going to be trying to do head studs, a built transmission, port converter, two-step, all that good stuff. Because as cool as the truck is now, it's got so much further that it can go. With that being said, guys, let's get our new giveaway vehicle unloaded off of the tow truck and check this thing out. Driving it. Okay, this thing has quilted seats in it. <laughs> that is so cool. Wait, hang on, let me get the exhaust. Are we gonna get a cold start? Oh, Nick got it. Uh, you right. know I got that cold start, boy. Wow. That's gonna be a lot of different sounding. I didn't expect that. Oh, yo! This is the number one wrap. Yeah. I didn't know that. Dolph number one, baby. Wow! So since the last time that we saw it, this truck has undergone some crazy changes. We literally have a brand new engine inside of here. A brand new, complete Gen 3 Coyote. Every single thing under here is brand new besides the Whipple. And it's only got 14,000 miles on it. Hell Horse banged this thing out in a really surprisingly short amount of time. And it's back. It's pretty cool. It sounds nice. It really does. It definitely all sounds brand new. Jeff left you a present in the back. Huh? Jeff left you a present in the back. Present? Hmm? Oh! That's sick, oh, dude. What? All right, pull out an ugly one. That is what happened to poor fucking the lightning whenever it was trying to raise Hank. 
This poor truck, dude. Oh! Bro, he's obliterated. Oh! This is what happens when you mess with Hank, though. Yeah, this is the heads up. You're gonna have to get rebuilt. <laughs> It's gonna be like an anime battle, and Hank's gonna be like, I see you've grown stronger since last we met. <laughs> Justin just thinks he's not gonna answer my phone calls. Well, we're gonna crash a lightning through his building. <laughs> Justin, look what we got back! What up? Check it out. It's almost sad. Come on, it ain't you sad. You want your money back? Huh? You want your money back? <laughs> I wanna show you something crazy, though. Oh. Isn't that crazy? You know that's your fault, right? I know it is. So this man outran me, blew, made me blow my shit up, and then bought it from me for cheap as f <laughs> If that's not a recipe of how to treat your friends, I don't know what is. Go enjoy it before my wife steals it from me. All right, I'll let you a little bit. Bunch of money. You'll be back to find it another giveaway. I know. Anyway. Danielle wins it back. <laughs> Tell Danielle to enter in the giveaway. When, when are you going to have so being that this truck is two-wheel drive and we're going to be doing a pull, i got to make sure that our tires are warm. Can't be doing a pull and no two-wheel drive. You know how many people wreck these trucks doing that? Not us. I just did something really stupid. What? I went to go reach my arm out to yell at you to tell you to get on the exhaust side so you can record. I have a f***ing diamond Rolex on. What is sharper than glass, stronger than glass? I went to go stick my arm out and crack the f***ing glass. Oh my gosh. So we're gonna have to get that replaced. Damn. <laughs> anyway, now that we got our tires all warm and sticky, we should be good to go for a little pull. Green light, green light. I cannot believe I still did that. That is so ridiculous. Definitely faster than Hank on pump gas. Okay, really, really unexpected to be honest. Really, really, really unexpected actually. This thing is fast. Quick trip back from Mexico. We are pulling back up at home here and uh, I think our neighbors are gonna laugh. Oh my God, our lawn guy is here too. They're gonna laugh. Another vehicle. <laughs> Tired. Oh, nice and grassy. Nice and grassy. They're covered in grass. Why would they be covered in grass? Probably because they're sticky. Doing some nonsense, I suppose. I smell some some warm we, parts. Uh, we did a pretty healthy little burnout and then went and took it for a pull. And it's fast. I'm just gonna tell you now, this is gonna shit on that truck. Really? On pump gas? If that truck's on pump gas, it ain't a it ain't a shot in the dark. Is it, what? I ain't shot in the f***ing dark. This thing on pump gas is yeah. so much faster than that was. Dang. This truck is so much lighter than that ever could have ever been on I was pump right gas. about the anime match. Oh yeah? Yeah, I was right. <laughs> this thing, I'm telling you, that truck turned down on E against this Whipple on pump gas is gonna be a it's gonna be a real close one. It's it's Hellcat fast. Like, I believe it with the Whipple. Yeah, it's pretty impressive. Dude. No passenger seat and no front transfer case and diff and axles and everything. Or bed cover. Or bed cover. Lighter brakes. Carbon fiber and hood. Please record this. Where the hell is that? Huh? Ah. <laughs> That's a machine gun? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> another camouflage, huh? Yeah, yeah, another camouflage. Well, that's nice. You can hide in the wood. Yeah, you can hide them and nobody would even see them. See you. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> On everything. That truck's real fast. I guess we should take them both to the drag strip. They're both dig worthy. They're sure not. That They're not. means uh, drive shaft and traction. Oh, we well, even first. partially imagine doing that. Okay. In fact, during that burnout, I stopped because I thought the drive shaft was gonna shoot through the bed there for a second. <laughs> so we'll definitely have to address that before. Anything. All right, we can go ahead and get that taken care I'll of. And lead. then they can have their proper rematch. Yeah, I'm telling you right now, that truck's gonna be that. It's gonna, it's going to beat that drug. Oh my god, dude.
I'm not kidding. Uh, Actually, the taillights! I just remembered those are the taillights that I've been wanting. And now I bought the truck so I can get the taillights on the truck. The backstory here is that I wanted those dark taillights from the day that we bought this thing. But Morimoto had them out of stock. And so I told Justin, I was like, sell me those taillights. I'll pay you and we can swap. And he's like, fuck you, I want those taillights. Well, now I bought the truck. So I'm going to take those taillights <laughs> and put them on my truck and put these on there. And those will definitely look better with the camo, I think. It'll be much more contrasting. It'll pop a lot more. Yeah. I think it'll fit in. So before we end this video, we have one more important thing to mention. Is it 10 times entries? Yes, it is oh 10 times entries. Oh my gosh. So crazy thing. If you grab any shirt just like this, or just like that, or just like that, at it's just a six dot com, you're gonna get 10 times entries to win this magnificent built C7 Corvette plus $15,000 in cash. More than just a shirt. Keychains, key tags, stickers, stickers hoodies. Hoodies? Yep. Joggers. Sandals. Swimsuits, Swim shorts, hats, anything, hats. literally anything. All right, well, with that being said, smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you guys next video. like I'm Tyson, sucking me clean like a Dyson. I'm going back to my old ways. Fuck it, I think that they like it. Come on, Danny. And then what? I need a Torx bit. This shit sucks dick. I'm trying to go home <laughs> and get lit. Instead, we're here try this. under this vet. Hey, try this. See if that works. This <laughs> is really big. Hey, man, I couldn't remember. That was a bad scan. Oh, okay. that bionic scan. All of my problems. He's smoking them down in the backwood. Pray to the Heavenly Father. Tell him that if I could change it, then I would.